hello guys in this short tutorial we are going to be looking at the battery management and uh, how can you manage your battery how to charge it so right now I'm using my tablet RCA and for it the battery is inbuilt and here they tell you the tablet has a, a built-in rechargeable battery and here they be showing you the status of the battery how it looks like in different events so the battery icon in the upper right corner shows the battery level or charging status so here the black one they show you it's full and the next one the second one they show you battery low then the next one it shows you battery needs to be charged and the one when it's charging it brings that thunder sign and here when i'm charging my tablet i use this alternate current adapter or a micro usb port to charge the battery and here they tell you things to note whenever you're charging in order to keep the battery working in the best conditions so guys as i'm going to be reading also pay attention and be reading here they tell you the included alternating current adapter is for use with the unit only make sure you use it only on this tablet or your phone this stuff of sharing chargers it does not work on this tablet so even they tell you do not use it with other equipment so the next one they go ahead and tell you please do not charge the battery in high temperatures which is obvious it's like when you're going to charge and put near charcoal stove a cooker yeah that's the same logic africans and they tell you to go and put your phone on charger here they call it omuliro you take it to the stove and burn it so please do not charge your battery in high temperatures do not wait for the battery to be fully depleted before charging again keep the battery charged as needed so as you can see mine on the upper right hand it's somehow not full it's on battery low level and it's not advised to for me to complete the old battery and i go charge it that's bad if the tablet has been used for a long period of time has not been used for a long period of time sorry the battery might be in over discharge protection mode and may take longer to charge it's like when you, i keep this tab for like seven years and i come back to charge it it may take a while when it's off or not functioning because it will be in that discharge protection mode until it gains some electricity or power to run so the tips on how you can prolong your battery life here are some of the tips for how to prolong the battery li the life of the battery so if you aren't using wi-fi you go to settings wireless and networks select wi-fi and turn it off the next do not leave the maps or navigation apps open on the screen when you are not using them and lastly turn down screen brightness and set shorter screen out time settings device display so i'm going to be showing you how you can do all this prolong first of all click all apps click settings in case you are you're not using the wi-fi as it is on right now slide this button and turn it off and next on display there are many options there there is the brightness level you can increase its brightness and it will be consuming a lot of power so i put it as a certain level there the brightness and secondly they said the sleep time or screen out time you select any of these it's a it's at five minutes 
you can put it on 30 seconds 15 seconds i guess that's it guys thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel i remain viral team from ug.com